Welcome everyone, it's Maria Morelli from Kelowna, BC, Canada. Today is going to be just a fun day. I'm doing a really decadent brownie. I'm calling it Mile High Crunch Cream Cheese Brownie. And it's just layer upon layer of time. So I'm just going to video what I'm doing here. And I've got my cake mixer going. And I'm doing up a chocolate fudge brownie in it today. And it's going to be mile high. It's going to have cream cheese in it. And it's just going to be so cool. I'm so looking forward to this. I have to get it nicely. I softened it in the microwave just to get it nicely softened. And all I've done is added um, two tablespoons of sugar and one tablespoon of milk and one teaspoon of vanilla. Two dollops of cream cheese into the fudge mixture. And we're just going to take a knife and we're going to do some little swirling. While we're waiting, we're going to get this in the oven. We're going to bake it for about 30 minutes at 350. Yeah. So we started our recipe with the light Philadelphia cream cheese with, that we put into our brownies. And now we're... Okay, so what we've done here, we've got our um, half a brick of the Philadelphia light cream cheese. I've got two tablespoons of sugar. And I'm going to add... I just happened to have, which was really great, and, and norm, you know, normally I don't, but I have some vanilla flavored coffee crystals here. So instead of adding the vanilla, I've chosen to use the vanilla coffee flavored milk and two tablespoons of the coffee, uh, French vanilla coffee flavor. So we're gonna put that into the cream cheese and we're just gonna mix it all up. Mm, it's gonna be delicious second layer on top of our brownies and uh, it's just, just going to be part of what's going to make them mile high. So over here on the stove is going to be my third layer. got some chocolate chips, about a cup and a quarter, um, just getting ready to be melted. I'm going to be adding um, one whole cup of peanut butter to the chocolate chips and then I'm going to be adding three cups of rice cereal. Okay, in goes our one cup of peanut butter and the rice crisps. We're adding our three cups of rice cereal. Okay, so our chocolate and peanut butter is nicely melted down. And while this is getting incorporated, we're going to just let it sit and cool for a few moments before we add it to our top layer of our mile high brownie. Okay, our brownies are done, they're out of the oven. We're going to just let that cool a little bit before we add on our topping. And we're going to make these mile high. I'm going to add this beautiful cream cheese, uh, vanilla flavored coffee, and a little bit of sugar in there as part of our frosting for the brownies. And then we're going to top that off with this wonderful crunch with the Rice Crisp cereal and chocolate and peanut butter mixed in there together. And we're going to have a little bit, I've just chopped up about one cup of um, salted peanuts and we're going to put that in the earlier I've gone ahead and made up my brownie uh, mix and our second layer is going to be and in that mix we've got our cream cheese um, mix inside the brownie there so cream cheese is going in here twice it's right in the brownie itself and now it's in the, in the brownie frosting so we're just going to kind of frost this brownie with this awesome cream cheese. You get so much versatility from it. You can pretty much make it whatever flavor you want. And that's what we've done here today. So we've got the mocha cream cheese flavor going on here. And on top of this, we're going to sprinkle our one cup of chopped fine peanuts. So we're just going to pile on our crunchy topping that's got the peanut butter and the chocolate and the crisp cereal. And this is what makes it turn into a mile high brownie. It's going to be so delicious. Alright, well we've had our uh, brownies cooling in the fridge. We're all ready to uh, get them plated. 
and believe it or not I'm going to be using an electric knife to cut these it just makes it so much easier and uh, so we're going to give that a try here we're going to give it a nice Well, I hope you're getting a good look at that. Well, there you have it. I've got our brownie all cut up. I've used the uh, electric knife to get my pieces out. And I've got them on the tray there for you. So this is my mild mild. It's a simple dessert. Well, I hope you're getting a good look at that. When you plate that up, it absolutely looks fantastic. So, crunch cream cheese brownie, and it's absolutely fantastic. It's got the layers of the cream cheese right in the brownie, and it's got cream cheese in the frosting, which is the second layer in there with that wonderful uh, vanilla coffee flavor. And the top is uh, crunchy with the rice crisp cereal in there. This is a decadent treat, it really is. Um, it's irresistible, it's a cinch to make, you must give it a try. So thank you for joining me today. It's Maria Morelli from Kelowna, BC, Canada. Thank you.